We know how much homeowners love to make their houses picture perfect. It can soon become a struggle though once you try to flatten out those pesky corners of a new rug. But there is one genius trick that can help. Just plop a few ice cubes and a heavy object on the corner and voila! Flat rug, no more tripping over the rolled up edges. Sitting in your car frozen and grumpy, watching your window slowly defrost is about as fun as watching paint dry. And let's not forget the disaster that is wiping the mist off the inside. But hey, if you don't want to risk getting slapped with a fine, you better give this funky demisting trick a try. People have tried it all, but apparently it was the cat litter that won the condensation game. Just grab an old sock or pair of tights, fill them up with cat litter, tie it up and plop it under your car's windows. It's so effective that it should do the trick in just 10 minutes. The cat litter works by absorbing the moisture in the air. Cleaning our stoves ain't fun either, let's be honest. But fear not, because one cleaning guru on TikTok has come to the rescue with a genius trick that'll make cleaning your stove a breeze. All you need is some oven spray, cling film, and a lot of patience. Start by spraying some cleaning product on the stove. Then cover the whole thing in cling film. Here's where your patience will be needed. You'll have to wait a whole day for the cleaning product to work its magic. But trust me, once you remove that cling film, the stains will have melted off. That leftover mess on your stove can be scrubbed off easily now. Finish the job using a regular cloth for the rest of the grind. It's time you forget about fancy schmancy car trash cans. Why waste your money on those when you can repurpose a plastic cereal container? It's small enough to fit in your car and the flip top opening means your trash won't go flying all over the place when you take sharp turns. Plus, just line it with a plastic grocery bag and you're ready to go. Feel like your feet need a bit of pampering? You can skip the expensive spa day at your local salon. All you need is a sanitary pad, some toothpaste and baking soda. Mix the toothpaste with the baking soda powder and spread it evenly on the pad. Place it on the soles of your feet and slip a sock on so it's nice and snugly. The pad should keep the mixture and moisture in so you don't make a mess all over your house. After an hour or two, rinse off the toothpaste mixture with plenty of water. You'll notice how soft the soles of your feet have become. For that extra step, add some moisturizer too. Those trusty sanitary pads can be used for all sorts of stuff around your house too like for freshening up your drawers. Just spritz some perfume on a pad. Place it next to your clothes of choice and voila! Your gym clothes, for example, will smell like a fragrant bouquet. And don't forget to throw one in your gym bag too. Oh boy, time to give those lampshades the love they deserve. Grab a trusty lint roller and watch in amazement as you unveil a whole new world of colors underneath that forever dust. Who knew your lampshades were secretly chameleon? Say goodbye to dog hair and hello to your new household best friend, the rubber squeegee brush. This bad boy can snatch up so much fur from your carpet that you'll be wondering if you even own a pet. Just stroke it short and quick over your rug and watch it unleash a furry storm. And if you're wondering about your hardwood floors, fear not. The rubber bristles work like magic to create one giant fur ball. Save yourself from cleaning cabinets and furniture tops by hooking them up with fashionable hats. They're made out of wax paper or paper bags. The dirt and grease will stick to your new accessories and when it's time for a new look, just swap them out every few months. You know that feeling when you finally peel off a bumper sticker or parking permit, but then you're left with a sticky mess? There's a simple solution though. Slap a wet piece of newspaper on top of that gunk and let it marinate for 15 minutes. Then poof, the glue will be as soft as a fluffy cloud and you can wipe it away with ease. If your dishwasher is stinking up your kitchen, it's time to get your detective hat on. Check that filter for any leftovers lurking in there. Then add a splash of vinegar to your next hot wash cycle. Those pesky food particles could be the culprits behind your dishwasher's funky fragrance. Get ready to be a Vaseline wizard. Say goodbye to pesky polish smudges with a simple solution. Slather some Vaseline around your nails before you go to town with a brush. Once you're done, wipe away the excess without the need for any nail polish remover. 
And if you're feeling fancy, make that perfume last even longer by adding a touch of Vaseline to your neck and wrists. It's like a scent superhero, keeping those fragrance molecules from flying away too soon. Have you checked out your shower curtain lately? It might be looking pretty grimy and gross. Toss that bad boy in the washing machine with a couple of towels and voila, no more soap scum stains. The towels will help with scrubbing away all that mess while they're tumbling in the washing machine. Say goodbye to single socks with a strip of foam pipe insulation. Measure and cut each piece, then place it in that sneaky gap between your washer and dryer or wall. Those pesky socks will never go missing again. Got a wobbly table that's cramping your style? Your trusty bottle cork is here to save the day. Slice off a piece of that bad boy, glue it to the wobbly leg, and voila! You've got yourself a sturdy surface to rest your drink on. A hammer is more than just a smashing tool. The back of this tool can actually hold a nail for you. No more risking your fingers or giving yourself a thumbectomy. Just slide it into the claw and bam, you're ready to nail it. Want to know the saucy way to pick up a sizzling lid? Ditch those boring oven mitts and grab yourself a pair of tongs. But wait, don't just go in head first. Use the middle. Trust me, it's hot and it's effective. Care to find out how to keep your dressing gown from slipping and sliding all over the place? Got you covered. Instead of going through all the loops, just place the cord through the front ones. You don't even need it to be wrapped around you. All the business will be in the front. Tie that cord up <laughs> nice and tight, and you'll be strutting around in no time. Bet you didn't know the right way to light a multi-wick candle. You'll never hurt the tips of your fingers again. Truth is, you don't light them one by one. Just light the first one. Then angle the candle in the right position so it lights up the other ones too. So, apparently, we've all been using deodorant wrong. Who knew? You're supposed to lather that stuff on before going to bed. That's because our underarms are supposed to soak it in overnight for maximum effectiveness. I'm here to save you from the USB struggle bus. You know that symbol on the cord? Yeah, it's not just there for decoration. Align the seam with the opposite edge of the tongue and voila, you're in business. No more flipping it upside down and sideways like a crazy person. Thank me later. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.